Hello, friends and family. I am at Gore's Nursery. You know this is my spot. I had a very sad thing happen. My yard man ran over my little lime tree that I was trying to get back to life. And my Meyer lemon tree. So he said he'll replace it. Replace them. And I'm fine with that. I'm not going to make him pay the full cost to replace because I am getting bigger trees this time. But look at here. I'm at my favorite Gore's Nursery. There is nothing in the tent. This is all the food they have. So if you got seeds, you better start them. And then she did tell me before when I was here that that was the last they were getting in. Uh, the food. So you might as well drop those seeds if you need to plant anything. Check your calendars. I'll probably put in the description box what's uh, Zone 9A calendar on my standard feed list. And um, drop your seeds because there is nothing here. However, this used to be full of flowers, full of plants, full of plants, full of plants. Empty. Now they do have all the landscaping supplies still. And they have all these big, big $200 and $300 fruit trees in the back but I'm going to get the last key lime that they have for $42 and the last my well they only have two Meyer lemons left for $42 these are the $42 trees. They're almost four feet tall because I'm 4'11 and they come to about my chest neck area. Um, but this is it. So if you don't have anything planted, see they have the smaller Persian lime, three gallon, but they're 35. So you might as well pay the extra $7. They have a few more of the $15 trees. Ponderosa lemon, I have one of those. Those are the big lemons that look like grapefruit. Do not have a Eureka, but they have a few of those. And a Meyer, they have a few of those. So if you need to start small, if you need to do it in a pot on a patio, come get you a $15 tree. When it's really, really bad, that tree might be producing and saving your life. And the, some of the $35 trees, like the navel orange, pretty big. But that got a little snail on it. I don't know if you can see that. But... Um, it's looking a little scarce. Real red grapefruit, satsuma, tangerine. You better get your fruit trees because this is really all I see in the for affordable range. Valencia orange, Hamlin orange, Ponderosa. I'm finna take one of these last two Myers. And the last thorny key lime. The last $42 one. There was no $15 ones. So, if you don't have your fruit trees, get your fruit trees. They have all this going on back here with the landscaping trees. I can't eat that. <laughs> they got a lot of landscaping stuff. But the food looking a little scarce. They had stuff all back beyond those fruit trees. I don't know if you could see it, but it looks empty now. And they close in a few minutes, so I need to go on ahead and make my purchase. Landscaping, landscaping, a few big, big fruit trees. If you need fruit this year, have a lot of space. But, man, y'all better get out of here, out here. I'm going to pause it, go buy. They have some $75 trees in the 10-gallon pot. Kumquats, calamondin, I'm growing those from seed. They have some stuff back there that's more expensive. Oh, they got a guava, Barbie Park guava for $40 back there in the back. Let's see if I can zoom in. I don't want to get wet with the sprinkler. A Barbie Park guava, so they have a few guava trees. But they're for, is that 40 or 140? It looks like 40. Um, the bigger $75 trees. But this is it. I'm used to this place being loaded down with stuff. But this is it. Maybe they scale back for the high heat of the summer. I'm going to ask and I'll bring an update, a car update. But let me get my trees, get checked out, and going to spend this money. 
and we'll see what happens but this is not looking good get your trees get your seeds dropped please it's an emergency okay so they still have some of the blueberry bushes the bigger ones $18 with blueberries on them now the ones we bought were six they had blueberries on them and they're still growing blueberries but they still have some they have this is the kind of well this is the nectarine tree that i believe i have too and it's full of nectarines but theirs is way more than i paid i paid 30 for mine and it was a little, not as quite as big but it's still produced in the first year um they have some apples 25 dollars, but you need like two apple trees to make an apple and they have pears okay so their pear trees are 30 bucks And I need to make sure I don't need two to make one because I sure don't have any. Their banana trees are 30. Mulberries are 12. Okay, that's not bad. Blackberries are 15. Pomegranates are 30. Mayhaw trees, $29.99. But look, it ain't that many. Tulip tree, I don't know. These all stuff is not full. Olive tree, $29.99. These are figs. Look like fig trees to me. Yeah, Cadot fig, river birch, LSU purple. So, look, and it ain't that many. Y'all better get out here and get y'all fruit trees. This is looking scarce. Woo. Here's the big peach trees. I don't know how much they are, but they're probably the expensive ones, Florida peaches. And maybe if I had that tree, I would have some peaches right now. And then these are the, the, the smooth skin, shiny avocados. I hate those, but these are the Florida avocados. And they never have a price on this. But this all they got. So if you like them, you better get out here and get your trees. I'm telling you, this is the scarcest. They got plenty of landscape, plenty of landscape, but the food is scarce. Oh my goodness, food shortage at the nursery. That's what I'm gonna title this video. So um, I thank you for watching. Hit like, comment, subscribe to my channel. I'm showing you out what's really going on out here in these streets now. Y'all better y'all better get something and grow it. Get you some food and grow it. Because this here is not looking good. This Florida heat ain't nothing. Ain't no joke. I'm telling you. If you step outside, you covered in sweat. But um, I did talk to the girl that works here. She said, I said, where's all the food? She said, we have had trouble getting it in. Oh my gosh, I'm glad I came and got my tree replacements when I did. She said, we have been trouble having trouble getting food in for months. I'm like, well, why aren't y'all doing your own starts? Because the feed stores pretty much do a lot of their own starts for, for themselves. That's why they may have the stuff that the nurseries don't. And Eat Your Yard does their own starts but they wait on bonnie to bring them in and they haven't been getting anything so if y'all know like i know if y'all don't see what's going on in these grocery stores y'all better open your eyes and see and get you some fruit trees established in your yard or in a pot if you renting so you could take them with you but this is, is getting crucial when the nurseries can't even get plants you need to drop your seeds on season. I will go ahead and try to take a picture of what's the plant in zone 9A right now. So you can get those seeds dropped and keep your food growing. Keep it growing. Keep it going so you will not suffer in these times. Because it is getting crucial. Every time I go to the store, a bell pepper has gone up about 5 to 10 cents. At a, every week, so there'll be two dollars for one bell pepper before you know it. Uh, four onions, a dollar eighty nine cent, almost fifty cent an onion. 
all that kind of stuff adds up. Celery used to be 80, 89 cent, now $1.35. So it's just going up and up and up and up. And y'all better get with the program. Better figure out a way to grow some thing. Trees yield, most, yield more food for the space that they take. These people are almost out of them. Check each your yard. Check here. Get you the, your favorite fruit. If you don't get but one, get your favorite fruit something please please everybody plant a seed plant a seed plant a seed i'm telling you plant a seed bye bye take care and have a great day on 9a here's what you could have dropped in may still got time if you need to you still got time this is jacksonville seasonal planting here's the june plants that need to be dropped start dropping them and I hope you got some slips. I'm hoping the slips I got growing naturally. I drop this stuff. Get these seeds in the ground. I think I'm going to drop me some peas and beans tomorrow. Bye-bye.